Y'all ready to get this tea? Cause I am. Hi and welcome to my channel. I'm Allie Fitz and I'm back with another video. And if you're new here, hello, I love you already. Make sure you slap that subscribe button to become part of the Fitz fam today. We pretty lit? It's true. And once you've done that, make sure to follow my social medias over here to stay connected with your girl and turn on those post notifications so you know all the tea first. Speaking of tea, my song Only For The Night is now available on Apple Music, iTunes, Spotify, all that stuff. So make sure you buy, stream, and download today because you just might get a shout out like, wait, Watch this video. You're down, I'm with it. Just seeing you here right now. Just got me reminiscing all night. Now I want you all night. Let's go. Come over, come over. And we can have a good night. Let's go have a good time back home. Come over, come over, come over. Cause I ain't craving nothing like I'm craving you. Want a taste of you and I know that you want me to. Thinking about all the things that maybe we could do. Just me and you, but only for the night Only for the night now, baby Only for the night now, baby Shout out to my girl, Riley. She really came through with that look. It's so cute. Can you do it on me, girl? But if you didn't get a shout out this time, don't worry. Just keep tagging me in your streams and I just might shout you out in the next video. Speaking of shout outs, I also wanted to do this new thing where I just shout out new Instagram followers just because. Shout out to these people. If you see your name, hello. I love you. Thanks for following. But now that that self promo is out of the way, it's Friday. That means more love island. So let's just jump back into it. I'm ready for the drama. Oh, ASMR. Ah. Welcome back to Love Island. The recoupling's just around the corner and everyone wants to know who's gonna pick who. With the boys choosing, the girls need to stay on top of their game. Everything could be about to change. And there's Erica up there and the three boys. Let's go talk to the three boys first. What's up, y'all? Rohan, Jake, and Tim are taking turns spotting one another in the gym. Ah, Alexa, thank goodness you're here. We need a girl's opinion. What's up? We've been talking about dates. What are you supposed to do when you take a girl to a restaurant? Seriously? Okay, first thing is to make sure your presentation is on point. I always check a guy's shoes first, so. Yeah, yeah, make sure you've had a shower, don't make slurping noises. That's not the bit we're arguing about. We're arguing about the bill and who should pay it. Um, the man, or whoever asked you on the date, really. Just split it, guys. It's 2019, we had to change that. Yeah, I mean, people always say that, but I know it's old fashioned in that, but do girls really wanna pay? No. These boys are so clueless. Of course we wanna pay, or it's about the principal. Or I don't mind guys paying, I don't mind. <laughs> I'm fine with a guy offering to pay for dinner. It only gets on my nerves when they insist on it after I said it's my turn. I'm not gonna like you more if you ignore what I wanna do. Yeah, I wouldn't do that. It's like when guys try to order food for you too. I'm like, mate, I know what I wanna eat. Let me do it. Plus, if you don't split the bill, it gets well expensive. Especially if you don't pre-lash so you have to buy booze there. Wow, pre-lash before going for a nice meal? Never come to my restaurant, mate. Oh, tea. What food do you guys get on a date? Well, I'm biased because my food is the best. Tea. I don't really take girls out for dinner much. Because you treat them like they can't afford it? No. I invite them around the kitchen after it's shut and make them something special. Oh, that's sweet. I bet you do, you cheeky bastard. Oh, I don't mean like, we don't hook up in the kitchen. It would be a hygiene issue. Well, changing the subject, what kind of food do you like on a date, Alexa? Just in case I ever take you out. Oh, really? My ideal date food is something really fancy, something cheap and fun, something I haven't tried before. Um, I don't like to get things I've never tried before because then what if I don't like it? It's a hassle, you gotta tell the waitress, I don't like this, and then it's awkward, and nah. So I'm gonna go with something really fancy. If I'm going to the hassle of getting dressed up and going into town, I want something lush. Good wine, rich food, starters, desserts, taxis home, a whole lot. Sounds like it give you indigestion. Ah, oh, Rohan sits up suddenly from where he's been lying on the weights bench. Oh my God, this reminds me. A couple of years ago, I was out with this girl. You with a girl? Bullshit. Rohan shushes him. Shh, I go on lots of dates of girls for your information. But this one time, I do that thing we've just been talking about. I'm being all Billy Big Balls and I've had a few drinks and I think it'll look flash if I pick up the whole bill. And I give the waiter my card saying like, oh, don't worry, babe, I've got this one. And the waiter comes back and whispers in my ear. And my card's been declined. T, well, we know who not to go out with. I'm just kidding. Well, she had to pay for the whole meal and she never called me back. 
So there's a moral there somewhere. All right, now that we're done talking to them, Erica, and then nah, we gonna go talk to Erica. In the dressing room, Alexa is trying to take a moment to herself. Erica, leave the poor girl alone. I don't know if she can handle another conversation about the recoupling. Hey Alexa, you feeling all right? What should I tell Erica? I'm feeling pretty good or not as good as I look or I've had better days, I'm feeling good. Winning that silly prize earlier actually meant a lot. And I think I'm all sorted for the recoupling later. Not too bad, all things considered. I wish I could say the same. Oh, what's wrong, girl? Erica's chatting away like she's forgotten I coupled up with Rohan. What's wrong? Or so we're friends again, are we? Or I don't care about your problems, that's rude. What's wrong, girl? Just something I heard today. I thought I better come and chat to you about it. Okay. So people are saying that Levi's gonna ask you to couple up with him later. Wow, word really goes around fast. I'm really excited about it, or I don't know how I feel about it, or that's the rumor going around. <laughs> um, I'm excited. Well, that's just great for you, isn't it? Well, do, do you like Levi now? She frowns and looks away. There's a bitter look in her eyes. Are you serious? What? I thought you'd be pleased. If he does couple up with me, that means Rohan will be looking to couple up with someone else. I even talked to him about it earlier. Yeah, I heard about that too. You said you wanted someone else to pick you, which means that you coupling up with him was all for nothing. No. You stopped us from being together even though you never even liked him in the first place. Okay. Okay, she's still pretty upset with me. Argue with her, reason with her, or say nothing. Can I try to reason? If you want him so much, you should go talk to him about it. I'm not his babysitter. Oh, okay. She shouldn't have said that. I was willing to put this whole Rohan thing behind us. I wanted us to be friends. I'm trying to reason. And then I look at you with like all the guys fawning over you. And then you get this stupid prize. Hey, don't take it out on the prize. I won that fair and square. I'm sorry, I shouldn't have come in here. I'll see you later. Like, is she jealous? She runs out before you can say anything else. Well, that was... What's gotten into everyone today? Anyways, um, I guess now we'll go talk to Miles, Allegra, and Jen. Let's see what they got to say. Jen, Miles, and Allegra are hanging around on the day beds. Oh, Alexa, you're here. Perfect, we've been meaning to ask. You and Timye are mates, right? Who's he gonna pick at the recoupling? Well, I don't wanna spread gossip. We'll all know this by evening anyway. And don't worry, we won't tell anyone until then. No, I don't even trust you. Who do I think Tim's gonna pick at the recoupling? Jen, Cherry, Talia, or none of your business? None of your business, girl! It's none of your business if he doesn't wanna talk about it. All right, fine, geez, I was just asking. Why all the questions anyway? We're trying to work out who's gonna pick who, duh. There's a recoupling this evening. Everyone's making secret deals. Are they? It doesn't seem that way to me. It just seems like everyone's hanging out as normal. You're just not seeing it, babe. Me and Miles are the only solid couple at this point. That's what you think. You're right about that. Everything can still change. I guess. I like where glances at you and then at Jen. So, any idea who's gonna pick you? Who do I think is gonna recouple with me? I'm hoping it'll be Levi or I wanna couple up with Talia or it's none of your business. None of it is her business, cause I don't like her. I guess I'll have to find someone else to get my gossip one with. But don't blame me if things don't work out how you want it because you didn't plan properly. Success like this takes hard work, you know. Allegra bites her lip and turns to Miles. Babes, I'm all tense. Can you give me a back rub? Ew. Miles gets a glint in his eye, and you and Jen make a hasty exit. Looks like gossiping about the other islanders really gets Allegra going. I'm just glad I'm not the one sharing a bedroom with them. All right, so who's left? This, oh, is that the recoupling? Okay, I guess we're going to whatever this heart is. Oh, what's this? Every day this week, one of the girls will get to take another islander on a shopping trip outside the villa. Alexa, you will go first and must stock up on treats for a cocktail party tonight after the recoupling, okay? Please choose an islander to accompany you. Um, Levi, duh. I could see if one of the girls wants to go with me as a friend, but I should really take someone I might want to couple up with. It's a good chance to see what they would be like doing something normal. Relationships are all about day-to-day -day stuff, really, aren't they? Take Levi, take Talia, or take one of the girls. I'ma take Levi, what's up? It'll be perfect, I'll go find him. You arrive at the grocery shop, the air is cool. So, we need to get snacks and drinks for this party. What should we get? My outfit's cute, by the way. Levi walks up to the fruit and vegetable section. I'm not great at cooking. I do make this wicked lasagna though. My grandma taught me. You have to start it at dawn, blanching the tomatoes in boiling water, then letting them sit so the skin comes off. While that's happening, you make a mound of flour on the worktop and break an egg into it. Babe, I'm gonna stop you right there. We don't have time to make our own pasta from scratch. Do you know how to make anything more like party food? He scratches his head. Um, beans on toast? You roll your eyes and look around the shop for inspiration. Tapas, veggie sticks, hummus and dip, or just crisps. 
I like veggie sticks, hummus, and dips. That sounds good. Yeah, sounds fine. You start grabbing the food you need. Hey, look over there, ice cream. Can we get ice cream? <laughs> you don't need to ask my permission if you want ice cream, hun. Great, I'm getting some. As you walk down the aisle, he puts his arm around your waist. Oh snap! You know what's better than ice cream? What? Making out in the freezer section. Oh, tea! What kind of a line is that? A cool one. Kiss him or shake your head. Kiss him! Eh. You set the basket down and stand on your tiptoes to kiss him. You look so good in the supermarket. Well, you know, thanks. Oh my God, what do I have to do to shut you up? You kiss him again. That'll do it. You feel him grinning as you slide your hand into his back pocket. Ooh. After a few more kisses, you realize that one of the clerks is looking at you and you pull away. Okay, should we get some kind of sweet food too? Yeah. I want ice cream cake or gummy worms. Ooh, gummy worms. That's a little bit out there, but I like it. The savory food says I'm sophisticated, but the dessert says I don't know what I'm doing. I was going for quirky. You grab what you need. Right, we're all done. I've never been so sad to be leaving a grocery store. Well, if you play your cards right, perhaps we'll go shopping again together sometime. That's a nice thought. Ew. Coming up next on Love Island, there's gonna be a recoupling. Did anyone mention that? Will Alexa end up with the partner of her dreams or will she get mugged off once again? The person I wanna couple up with tonight has been a really strong presence in the villa since day one. Things haven't quite worked out for her tonight, but I know we all want them to in the future. The girl that I want to couple up with is. You won't want to miss it. We gotta find out. Last time on Love Island. The rated challenge brought out Allegra's true feelings. I didn't want to date any of you anyway. The boys choose at the recoupling everyone has been waiting for. The person I want to couple up with tonight has been a really strong presence in the villa since day one. Things haven't quite worked out for her tonight, but I know we all want them to in the future. This girl's super fit, we have a great balance together, and I'm really excited to see how things develop. Let's find out. In the dressing room, Alexa and Jen are getting ready for the big night. Jen is sitting opposite you at the table, putting on her makeup. She keeps glancing at you over the top of her mirror. Ugh, I can't get this right. My hand keeps shaking and I'm messing up my eyeliner. Would you mind helping me out? She's obviously way stressed. Of course, or I won't be much better, or I'm too busy right now. I mean, honestly, doing other people's eyeliner, I am not good at. I won't be much better, but I can try. Jen looks relieved and hands you the applicator. Thanks, hon. I appreciate that. You do your best to follow the line she started, but you can tell she's watching you closely in the mirror. Are you feeling as nervous as I am? I don't know about that. Jen seems like she needs to talk. What's on your mind, girl? Spill it. You are, sweetie. She pauses. Oh, about... Okay, I get it. Not like that. I mean, you and Levi are what's on my mind. What do you mean? Since day one, I've noticed the way Levi looks at you, and I've always thought, at least he's still coupled up with me. It didn't bother me as much before, but now the moment's come where he's going to have to choose. T. I'm not going to just step aside and give you my blessing, but if he chooses you tonight, I need to accept that things just weren't meant to be. Oh, wow, Jen. Then I can start moving on. You notice a tear start to form in the corner of her eye. Wow. Wow. I'm taking her man and she's crying. Wow. Oh my God, don't cry. You'll ruin your makeup. Yeah, I need to get a grip. She takes a couple of deep breaths and steadies herself. I've been really pushing for things to work out between me and Levi. But now I can see that maybe we're not right for each other. Would it be better for me if she thinks that? Why do you say that or do you like someone else or I agree with you? Um, do you like someone else? Maybe you could have a backup plan? That would make things easier for you, wouldn't it? Actually, I do think I might like someone else, but I don't want to say too much about it yet. I wonder who she got her eye on. Still, nothing is set in stone yet, is it? I guess not. And I'd like us to still get on. I think you're a decent person, whatever happens between us. Okay, same, Jen. Sounds like the moment of truth. Jen makes some final adjustments, then carefully puts her makeup away before reading the text. Islanders, it's time for tonight's recoupling. The boys should sit around the fire pit and the girls should line up in front of them. Oh God, I've been chatting so much, I'm not even ready. There's no holding back now. We're gonna be standing up there and I've gotta look my best if I want the right person to choose me. What should I wear? Cute cowgirl, little black dress, or basic evening wear? I'm not about to be basic, so let's see the cowgirl. Oh, that's cute, but let's look at the black, whatever it was, little black dress. Can never go wrong with that. Oh, wow. Yeah, you can never go wrong with that. That's the one. No one is gonna look as good as I am out there. I've gotta say, you do look amazing. 
Come on, the boys will be waiting. All right, y'all, the moment of truth. It's decision time in the villa, and it's down to the boys whether to stick in their couple or shake things up. You can almost smell the tension in the air around the fire pit. Or is that Mason's new cologne? The boys are already sat around the fire pit as you and Jen walk up. You glance around at the boys, trying to make eye contact and suss out what they're thinking. Mason is grinning confidently. Levi looks nervous. What you looking nervous for, Levi? You know who to pick. All right, girls, wanted to keep us lads waiting, did you? You find a place in line next to Tilia. She reaches down and squeezes your hand. Good luck. On your other side, Erica's looking straight ahead. She don't like me no more, y'all. I lost my friend. Erica was so off with me earlier. Wish her well, make a snide comment, or say nothing. I'm still nice. I'm gonna wish her well. Good luck. I hope it goes well. Erica smiles weakly at you. Aw. Okay, here we go. The order for the recoupling will be Miles, Levi, Mason, Rohan, Tim, Jake. Okay, Levi a second. He better do what he gotta do. There's a whisper of discussion around the group before the weight of the moment settles on everyone. Miles stands up in front of the girls. I guess I'll kick things off then. I'm choosing this person because in the time that we've been together, I feel like we've become the strongest couple in the villa. Mm-hmm. I find her unbelievably attractive. I've never been with someone who turns me on as much. Okay, okay, enough. Gross, dude. So I've gotta say, to me, she's the most dateable girl here. All right, whatever. The girl I wanna couple up with is Allegra. We been new, everybody been new. Like this if you been new. Allegra skips over to Miles and kisses him passionately. Babe, you're so sweet. They sit down together. At least they seem happy. Smile at them, I'll smile. Miles smiles back at you. Levi stands up next. He looks a little unsure of himself. Levi, I swear. Okay, so I feel like I've been waiting a long time to have a chance to say this. The person I want to couple up with tonight has been a really strong presence in the villa since day one, and I've had an amazing time getting to know her. In the last few days, I've been doing a lot of thinking about what I really want, but I wasn't sure until today when this girl showed me I was making the right decision. And I've got to say, she's looking particularly fine tonight. The person I want to couple up with is better be me. Y'all, it better be me. Alexa, whew, that was a close one. Oh my God, he picked me. There's a shocked silence. You look at Jen, but she's looking down at the ground. She doesn't say anything. I stole her man too, y'all. <laughs> Alexa evil, how should I react? Kiss Levi, hug Levi, or talk to Jen? I'm gonna do what I gotta do. You stand on tiptoes and plant a kiss on Levi as soon as you get near him. You sit down next to Levi and he puts his arms around you. Mason stands up, he looks confident and smiles at all the girls still standing. Evening ladies, I'm not big at the speeches so I'm just gonna come out and say it. This girl's super fit, we have a great banter together and I'm really excited to see how things develop from there. So the girl I wanna couple up with is Cherry, we been new. Cherry grins and stress over to Mason. He plants a kiss on her and they pose for the group, flexing and pouting. Everyone cheers. <laughs> okay, I guess it's me next. He stands up in front of the group. So obviously I can't choose the girl I was coupled up with before. So the girl I wanna couple up with is someone I've also had feelings for since I've come into the villa. I hope she feels the same way and I'm looking forward to getting to know her better. The girl I wanna couple up with is Erica. <gasps> Yay, I'm glad he picked Erica. I'm glad he picked her. He opens his arms and Erica runs into them. She hugs him and they sit down together. She looks really happy. Good. You catch her eye and her face falls immediately. What's the issue, Erica? I don't know what's gotten into her. She should be happy now, right? Say something nice, say something mean or leave it. I'm leaving it. You start to speak and then close your mouth. Erica just pouts and turns to Rohan. Well, looks like there's only two girls left. Thanks for reminding us. Poor Talia, she deserves everything. But you should both be feeling great because one of you is coupling up with me tonight. The girl I wanna couple up with is someone who makes me laugh, who always has a smile on her face, and most importantly, looks banging in a bikini. The girl I wanna couple up with is Talia. Oh snap, okay. Well, I guess that makes sense. Talk to Talia, encourage Jen, or say nothing. I ain't saying. You watch as Tim and Talia take their seats. Okay, well, looks like it's my turn. Now, obviously, I don't have much choice right now, but that doesn't mean I'm not happy about it. This girl is a really strong member of the group who we all really like. Things haven't quite worked out for her tonight, but I know we all want them to in the future. So I'm really pleased to couple up with this girl as friends and I'll happily step aside when the time comes. Aw, he's so nice. Come on, mate, the suspense is killing me. Okay, the girl I wanna couple up with is Jin. Aw, Jin walks over to Jake and they hug. Oh, she don't look okay, she looks mad. Thanks, Jake, that was really sweet. You look around, taking in everyone in their new couples. Allegra and Miles are already all over each other. What's new? Well, look at that. Six couples all sitting calmly together by the fireside. They look happy, don't they? 
I'll bet nothing can spoil this moment. Levi, can I have a word? Oh, looks like I spoke too soon. What's about to happen? Whilst the other Islanders take some time to bond over the quality of the tasty treats Alexa bought, Levi's got himself in a bit of a pickle. I'm not upset, I'm disappointed. I put a lot of effort into this relationship and you couldn't even be bothered to give me a proper breakup. Oh, you just coupled up with someone else. That's not fair. We both knew this was coming. It's not like it was out of the blue. Oh no, they're talking about me. I should interrupt them, stand watch, or leave them alone. Oh, I'm getting the tea. You watch as Jen takes Levi's hand and then gives up and turns away. It looks as though she's crying. I'm sorry, I can't do this right now. Oh, the drama, the tea. She walks away. Well, that could have gone better. You sit down on the day beds next to Levi. He looks troubled. He really got into it just then. That didn't look much fun. I'ma say that. <laughs> Levi smiles. Yeah, it wasn't. I'm not bothered though. You gotta face some challenges to get what you want. Oh, and did you get what you want? I hope so. I think you're worth fighting for. <gasps> a man. He's a pretty smooth talker sometimes. I think you're worth the wait. Or I'm glad you fought for me or you haven't won yet. Oh, I like both of these. You haven't won yet, let's keep him on his toes. No, of course, but I think we're on the right track now. I'm really excited about us being coupled up for the first time. I know there's been a bit of drama to get here, but I think we should forget about that for now and just enjoy the moment. I'm really looking forward to getting to know you better. Oop. He's coming on to me. Everyone else is in the kitchen and we're finally coupled up together. It might be nice to go and get some space away from the other Islanders. I mean, should we sneak off together? Yeah, why not? Great, anyone in here? There's no answer. I guess we're alone. He leans over and kisses you full on the lips. His mouth tastes sweet. Are you wearing flavored lip balm? Yeah, I borrowed it off Cherry. <laughs> That's a little strange, but okay. Your lips are soft at least. You kiss him again and he wraps his arms around you, pulling you closer. It's so nice to get you on your own for a bit. Oop, I know. I feel a bit exposed though. Levi pulls a blanket from one of the beds and wraps it around the two of you. Oh snap, no one will be in here for a while. He kisses you again. It seems like no one's around. Kiss him back, go further, that's enough for now. Mm, I'll kiss him back. Suddenly, you're both lying on the bed, kissing each other deeply. Everything becomes a tangle of bodies and sheets. You can feel the electricity between you. Oh, y'all. You hear a sound from the kitchen and realize how close you are to the group still. The kiss is intense and long-lasting. Eventually, you both stop and look into each other's eyes. I guess that's as far as we should go out here. You're probably right. I wish it wasn't, though. He looks at you with longing. Oh, wow. I'm looking forward to a time when we can just do whatever we want, whenever we want. What do you mean? You know. What do you think we might get up to if it was just the two of us right here? You right. I wonder what he's talking about. Don't be dumb, Alexa. We would do the same thing we do in here or get off with each other constantly. Wow, or dress up in each other's clothes. <laughs> what would happen if I said that? You know what? I'm saying that. Um, if you like. Oh my gosh, I was kidding. Is he serious? I was thinking we'd stay in a hotel somewhere. We'd go get breakfast, then I'd swim, and then we wouldn't leave the room for the rest of the day. Levi's got a plan. That sounds great. I know, right? I know it's great because me and my ex used to do stuff like that. Okay, well, don't tell me that. Levi looks lost in his thoughts for a moment. I probably shouldn't have mentioned that. Yeah. Shall we head back? I suppose so. He stands up, kisses you gently, and walks off towards the kitchen. Why did he say that? So, no surprises for guessing that Miles and Allegra would couple up again. But the story of the night has to be Alexa and Levi. What a shock. I thought for sure he was gonna choose me. <laughs> Next time, there's even more drama in store when something goes bump in the night. Oh, snap. Oh my God, Alexa, what did I do? I think we all need to step away from this situation before it gets out of hand. What did I do? Don't miss it. Uh-oh. So, it looks like we got our man Levi. Jen's mad. Erica's mad for some weird reason. Doesn't she have Rohan now? Why is she still mad at us? Does she secretly like Levi too? Because that's... I didn't know that. And plus, he's the one who chose, so it's really not my fault. <laughs> but if you enjoyed this video and want more Love Island tea, make sure to give it a thumbs up and share it with all your friends. Let everybody know that this tea right here is hot. And don't forget to buy, stream, and download my song only for the night because it's a bop. And you don't want to be left out, do you? So have a great day in the name of the Lord, and may God bless you every step. On my phone, I gotta get this sky. This, the, the view, the view of the sky. I had to get that on my phone.